Hey everyone, welcome back to Adventure Quest World Tutorial. This week I'm taking a break from the normal storyline video, and I'm going to be bringing you the Blinding Light of Destiny Part 2. One of Arctic's merge shops this isn't exactly uh, the Blinding Light of Destiny, but Demio, you can get the armor Demio. Demio is only available once a year, and that is on the birthday for June 1st. Uh, a few months ago, they introduced Undead Energy. Undead Energy can now be used to make Spirit Orbs. You need 50 Undead Energy to create one Spirit Orb. Now, last time we left off, there was you trade in a 100 Spirit Orbs to get a Loyal Spirit Orb. And it is said that a bunch of loyal spirit orbs could be merged to get the Blinding Light of Destiny. Well, now there are brand new items. So the rundown is you need a hundred spirit orbs, which you can get from merging or doing the essential essentials or bone dust quest. The essentials essentials quest now gives a random chance to get 5, 10, 15, or 20 spirit orbs. You complete that and you merge to get a spirit, a loyal spirit orb. You need 25 loyal spirit orbs, or no, 50 loyal spirit orbs to merge a bright aurora. And you need 25 bright auroras to merge a brilliant aurora and who knows how many brilliant auroras or bright auroras or whatever you need to get the blinding light of destiny but that's not all you need but in total to get one brilliant aurora you need 125,000 spirit orbs so that takes a lot of farming so far I have nine loyal spirit orbs and probably spent about seven or eight hours farming. Some new quests include minecrafting. Minecrafting you use and you can get the following items aluminum, barium, gold, iron, copper, silver, platinum. You do that by getting the drops. Seems to be a lot of people farming for him. You can attack the Barbos Crafts. Once you get one of those, let's say I got silver. Since I have a silver one, we'll test it. The Sanctified Silver Enhancement. I have one silver, so I use 25 Undead Energy. Five spirit orbs, and I need to get some paladoli. You can get that by dropped by marsh tree, tree nint, and wisteria. And you can get the sacrifice silver or whatever item you're going for. And then that could be used to merge the Sanctified Silver of Destiny, and you may also receive 100 Spirit Orbs. So that's a little interesting. So we still don't know how many how many of these silver or aluminum or barium or gold items we're going to need, or how many of the Brilliant Auroras, but still it is going to take farming the quest, and for the Merge Shop items, it will take probably around 36 to 48 hours of farming. I don't know if people are non-stop farming or if people are using legal bot programs still to do that. But either way, we should start seeing the more Blinding Light of Destiny quests and maybe they'll start adding in a couple easier ways to get more spirit orbs.